Theme from Witch's Dance. Let's start at the beginning. We're gonna use hooked bows. So we're gonna be going down, down, up, up, down, and then there's a rest, so you wait, and then you grab the string, because it's a, an accent. Punch! Okay, and then down, down, up, up, down, and then punch, punch. Down, down, up, up, punch. And here's a four. And then a... Okay, make sure there in measure seven that you have your C sharp nice and high. And lift. Hooked bows. Down, down, up, up, down. Uh, accent. Bam. Down, down, up, up, down. And this one, make sure your F sharps are high. So F sharp here, that's the two, high two on D. Okay, and you might have noticed in bar three, go take a look at this. What's the last note in bar three? It's a D sharp. That's a high three on the A string. So really high three. There it is, you hear that? Just match that, make sure it's right, and then four, right? That's why they say four on the music there. Down, down, up, high three, four, open, okay? And you also have that in bar nine, 10, 11. So both bar three and bar 11, make sure you take note of that high three. Okay, and then in 17, Make sure your C-sharp is nice and high. That's that two on A. Lift. Guess what? That's the same thing, just on a different string, right? Hop over. Right, same thing. And then here, we have four, high two, which is G-sharp. Open E. Back to the G-sharp. And then back to just like measure 17. Okay, now here we get into the good stuff. Bar 25, we changed to kind of a minor sounding part. So we're gonna do A, which is the three, low two G, F natural, that's a low one. Open E, low one, which is F natural, C natural which is a low two, but it doesn't feel like a low two because it's higher than your, your one, right? Normally, your one is up here, and a two is a, a, a whole step above. But you're on your low one on E, and then you do your low two, okay? And then you're gonna do, uh, do this. I want you to first try, just play open E, F sharp, G natural, which is a low two, A, and then B flat, which is the four right next to it. Look at this. Caitlin, or anyone else doing it, it's low four and three right next to each other, and then low two and one right next to each other, okay? Now when you have that, now you can do this bar 25 to 27. Bar 27. So you can get your fingers back in place. One, two, is right next to each other. Three, four, right next to each other. And then we try it again. I love the sound of that. That's so nice. And then 29, low one, F natural. Normal three on the A. C sharp, which is high two. And then we're back. Make sure and pause and then accent. Wait. Good. Okay, this is a part that you want to practice a lot. This bar 37. It's down, down, up, down, up. Okay, so it's one, open E, low two, which is G, A, B, 
G, A, B, those are all whole steps. Low, two, three, four. Okay, so it's down, down, up, down, up. And then the last part. Okay, so here at 38, low two. Make sure you use the low two, which is G. And then C sharp, now we're at high two. Still high two. And I like leaning into this. Makes it more interesting. Okay, have fun with that. When you get comfortable with the olives, of course, break this into small sections that you can really take bite size. And when you get good at it, then um, just work with the recording. Okay, well done.